Hi guys, how you doing? It's Jasmine here of Ring Around One Gaming or Ringa. You can call me whatever you want. Terrible, horrible person. You know, I don't know. I don't know. Whatever you want to call me. <laughs> I was trying to think of something like super clever, and then it just couldn't. Because I'm not clever, and I don't think of clever things ever. It just happens. Yeah. Um, I just wanted to say hi. I was a little jittery before. Uh, this is like right before I'm filming tonight's, like tomorrow's episode of uh, Random Nights with Ringa, and I just wanted to film because I'm like, no, nah, I gotta do something. I'm tired of sitting here. I've been watching Japanese and Chinese and Korean horror movies lately, and Thai, Thai movies too. I will talk about that tonight um, in my videos. I'm sure I had a plan for like tonight's videos and like something I was going to talk about, but I don't remember what any of that was. So, you know, it's just going to be like a thing. I don't know. It's just like, I don't know, I, I guess I really, like, it's not like I don't plan these out because it's supposed to be random, so I'm not like... So it's like, I'm not trying to plan on what I talk about, but that came to me just now because I was like, well, if I've been watching them a lot lately, it's kind of like current events, and I could be like, yeah, great. Look at my, like, super awesome monocle. Isn't this the business? Hmm. Yeah. I want to move this. Yeah, and I took it right off. It just snaps on, and it, like, snaps onto, like, this piece here, so it, like, it's difficult to keep it on. Sad face. But I got this monocle, like, to go with my, um, my mask, because I kind of thought they'd go well together. Like, they may not, actually. Like, this might turn out to be bad, but... Like, I got a mask, and, um, uh, I'm sure I've already shown it in, like, some of my pictures or my videos or whatever, but it's, uh, like, a Phantom of the Opera mask. This was in one of my videos, I think. I don't know. I don't remember, but it's, like, really cool, and I figured this eye is not covered. I could put a monocle there, or I could just leave it blank or something. I'm gonna do, like, some, like, really cool, like, cosplay with it. I just don't know yet what I want to do. So, you know. Yeah. Itchy. Itchy face. My face is so itchy right now. I'm hungry. I'm like starving. And I'm not like actually starving. I'm just hungry. Oh, I have a drink down here. I forgot all about my drink. Also, I'm pretty sure I still have Sassy. I mentioned her in this last video that I posted today. Um, I just... I still have her, I just don't know where she is. Or if I don't have her anymore, then I got rid of her within, like, the last year. Uh, I'm drinking kombucha again. This one is blueberry pomegranate flavored, and it's got, um, acai and goji berries in it. Isn't that how you say it? Acai? Like, or, like, like, you know. I don't know. I'm not fancy. Anyways, I will see you guys later. And if I end up not talking about Japanese horror movies and stuff like that, then we'll see what I talk about. I am not going to talk about Japanese, like any kind of Oriental Asian-y movies that are scary. Because I'm going to leave that for another time. Because it's not random enough. But if I'm planning on talking about it, then it's not random. So I'm going to talk about something else. Let's think in my brain of braininess of what I could talk about. I mean, oh goodness. Ah. Languages. Let's talk about languages. Have I already spoken about this? Let's do it again. I have fascination with languages. Like, I want to learn, like, almost every single language known to man. 
not all of them, because some of them sound really difficult, and I'm not planning on going to some of these places that they speak this language. But, in no particular order, starting with the best one ever, and no, I'm just kidding, <laughs> in no particular order, but the first one is the best one ever. No, I want to learn Japanese, which is one I'm learning right now. I actually have a book about it. Yeah. Screw it, I have like a bag on top of my stuff over here. <laughs> I have just like a pile of like stuff I have to take out and like get rid of. And my cats have been sleeping on it, so I'm just like, yay, I almost pushed that the wrong way. Um, I have this book. Um, this is not how I'm learning Japanese, but this is helping me learn how to write it. And it's, uh, this, um, no, I'm not sponsored by Dagny, Dagny, whatever. I'm terrible, I'm terrible with names. I'm not sponsored by this person who made this book or anything like that, but it teaches me how to write it and how to understand whenever I'm seeing something, what it means and how it sounds. And there's like four million different alphabets just for Japanese. There's like hiragana and katakana and like a bunch of other things. I've only learned those two so far, so I could probably write something for you. Hold on. Let me get something to write on and I will write my name for you. Okay. All right, now this is a terrible version of it because it's written with this marker and my book kept sliding. Excuses, excuses. But this is basically my name. Oh, it's backwards. No. <laughs> my bad, guys. I should have written this backwards or something. But this is backwards. So it's uh, Ja. Su. No. Yeah. Ja. These two. Tsu. Me. Mm. Is that backwards for you guys? It's... It might not be backwards for you guys, but I think it's backwards for you guys. Anyways, this is how I speak. <laughs> but, um. I already put the lid back on it. I'm not going to take it back off. But yes, this right here, this part, these two symbols together are, um. The hiragana, I made this a little too big. This just should be smaller than this, honestly. But like I said, marker. This, the rest of these are uh, hiragana, but this is katakana in the front there. So, you know. It's whatever. I wish I, like, if I had, like, a pencil, I would have been able to do it a lot better. But all I had was this giant marker to write with. <laughs> Something else I keep on my desk. Actually, everything is clean except for the peanut butter. So, you know. Kinda. There's still some things over here. Like, I, like, I, like, I, like it's, it's late at night, so I have a new collection of objects. But, so, Japanese. I like Japanese a lot. I do. Um, hopefully, I will get, like, super fluent in it and be, like, amazing and get, like, some Dragon Ball Z offers. Akira Toriyama, please. I want to be in your Dragon Ball. Like, if you watch this, anybody who knows Akira Toriyama, like, just send him over here. Akira, I'll be in your, I'll be in your stuff. I will study every single day until I learn the script and I learn Japanese and I understand it. And I will be in your Dragon Ball Super if you please just let me. Or just come and ask me and you can take a look at my script because I have my own side thing. So if you want to like, get in with this, you should get in with this. Because I have like some amazing stuff that you should read, for real. Um, um, I also like Chinese, by the way. <laughs> um, not to go off on a tangent about Dragon Ball Z. But I um, also like Chinese. Chinese I was actually learning for a while. But it is difficult, man. It is hard. Like... It is really, really, really difficult. Like, I mean, I was catching on really quickly, but I feel like Japanese, I can just say something however I want to say it and put inflection wherever I want to put inflection. I'll just sound like I don't know what I'm saying or like I'll sound like I just don't know Japanese, but the words I'm saying will be correct. In like Chinese, you have like, and not, not just like Chinese, Chinese, like Mandarin, I should say, like, you have to make sure that inflection is on point, because otherwise you are going to be saying some stuff. Um, but I like Mandarin, Cantonese, Taiwanese. I like 
um, just Thai, like from Thailand. Uh, I don't know exactly what that would be. I, I get the, like everything mixed up. Um, I like all of those things. Like, I listen to music like that, and, like, I will, like, sing along. Um, uh, Korean, I want to learn Korean. Korean is, like, a mix. It's both easy, like Japanese, and difficult to the max, like Chinese, like Mandarin. Like, it is difficult. Korean is really hard to learn, because I learn, like, phonetically. And... If I can't see how they spell each thing, like, phonetically, and be like, oh, this is how you'd say that, I'm lost. And have you seen how they say things? Like, oh my gosh. Like, they say things that are really difficult. Like, just look up, like, I know that, like, if you want to say hello, it's like, annyeonghaseyo. But, like, if you look up the word, annyeonghaseyo, it's like A N N H A Y E S E O. Like, they have like a lot. Like, and to say, like, what is it? Like, thank you. Like, come some da. Like, it sounds easy. Come some da. But it's not at all. It's not easy. It's difficult. Um, oh, ni hao is hello in, uh, in, uh, Mandarin. But, like, uh, I think you have to, like, be like, ni hao, and then, you know, konnichiwa, but, um, in, like, one of my videos, in my nighttime rant videos, I said, yasumi nasai, which is, uh, basically good night, but I said that because it was nighttime, and I didn't want to say konbanwa, which is good evening, because it's not evening necessarily, it's, like, late at night, so it's whatever. I don't know. I don't know. I may not speak it correctly, but I am learning it. So, that's all I could say. Um, I like, uh, Russian. I want to learn Russian, but, like, man, Russian is, like, by far, like, hard. Like, if you think that the things are hard to spell in Korean, like, Russian makes no sense to me. Like, I went to, like, find out how to say hello, and the easiest way I found out how to say hello is, like, greetings, which is, like, privet. Or something like that. But that's the easiest way I know how to say it. The other way was so long. The word was like... And it was like... K-K-S-S-R-P-P. -P. Like, it was not, like, as bad. It, and it wasn't spelled with those letters, probably. But it was, like, double-double consonant, double-double letter, like, double vowel. And I'm like... <laughs> um, Hawaiian? I'm not bad at Hawaiian, but I'm not great. Like, I can't necessarily speak it. Um... They say uh, aloha um, for a goodbye and hello. Uh, mahalo. Nah. <laughs> I like Hawaiian, though. It's, like, so, like, I don't know. It's so ethnic and so tropical. It's, like, such, like, a, a thing. You don't get that confused with any other language. I mean, not necessarily with the other languages, either. Like, you know what they are when you hear them. But, like, there's something about, like, Hawaiians. It's just, like, they got it. They got it. They know. Um... I want to learn German. German's difficult for me because the only people I've ever, like, met is, like, whenever they actually know it, like, they'll, they'll just, like, hit you with it. And they're like, oh, I'm going to speak in German now. And you're like, okay. <laughs> um, but I'd like to learn German. Um, I sing along with, like, a lot of German songs. And, uh, I mean, like, I can sing in almost every single language, like, that I've named. Like, almost every single one of the languages that I've actually named, I can sing in those languages. It's just fully understanding, like, the f complete song. Like, I understand what it's about and what they're singing about, like, and what the words mean. But it's like, whenever you go to speak it, you're like, I can't, my, my thoughts can't process it. And it's easier to sing along because there's a beat. So I know how to go with that beat. So, you know, there's only, there's only, like, 20 songs that I sing where I don't have any clue what they're singing about. I have no like no idea what's happening. And I'm just like, yeah, I'm just going to sing with this. Because, yeah, whatever. <laughs> but the rest of them I'm pretty good with. It's not much. Um, I like um, Romanian. Romanian is actually one of the first languages that I tried learning. Um, not like in school, but like by myself whenever I realized I liked languages. It was with, uh, Dragostad Dente, 
um, it's a song. It's, like, known as the Numa Numa song by that guy who, like, dances and he, like, puts his arms up and stuff. He was really cool. He was, like, the Numa Numa guy for, like, a long time, and I loved the song, and I looked it up because I thought it was hilarious, and I fell in love with, like, everything. It was saying my ozone. Um, so... And, like, that's what got me on the track to learning all the songs, because it's, it's in a million different languages, which I know. I can sing them. I can sing them all, <laughs> except for, like, the Brazilian one and stuff like that. Like, I don't, I didn't learn the obscure, ver like, versions of it, but, um, cannot sing the Korean version. I can sing the Chinese version. I can sing the Hebrew version. Hebrew is another language that I like, but I can sing those versions. Um, but yes. So, um, I didn't say, um, hello in German, did I? I don't know how to say, uh, hello in German. <laughs> um, hallo or salut is, uh, no, I think it's just salut, because hallo is, uh, Hebrew. Hebrew says hallo, hallo with like an H, and then allo and salut is, uh, Romanian. You think that I'd be able to say hello in German, but I've gotten like so many languages in my head right now that I can't like focus on it. But whatever. Um. Um. Anyways, and then I liked French, but I learned French here. I'm really good at French, actually. I just like left it behind. Like after I got out of classes with it, and like I mean like um college classes. I was in like class in college. And I got really into it, and then I just left it behind. Because it's like, I don't want to be like everybody else and learn Spanish or French and, like, go on with my life. Because, I mean, yeah, we, that would be, like, the most beneficial. Honestly, Spanish. We have a lot of Spanish-speaking people in my area. And they come in all the time, and, like, everybody says I look like I'm from Puerto Rico. And so they want to speak Spanish with me. And I'm like, <laughs> nah. Solo un poquito. Uh... Or solo un poco. Either way, I think it's correct. I could say that. That means I only speak a little. Um, or only a little or something like that. Like, usually if they ask if uh, habla espanol, you say solo un poco or solo un poquito. Uh, something like that. Like, I don't know very much Spanish, honestly. Like, Spanish is the one I know the least of. Besides, besides Rus Russian. Uh, and Spanish is really hard for me. Like, French was easy. Like, you could just be like, bonjour, and it's so amazing, and I've already spoke about this in another video, and, like, it's a very sexy language. Like, yeah, they might be angry, and they may hate us Americans, but they have a very sexy language. Like, they could be, like, cussing you out, and you're like, yeah, you like that? <laughs> what? <laughs> I don't know where I am right now. Oh, video went dark. Yes, it's about time. Anyways, um... Also, the light has been on this whole time, and I forgot to turn it off, so what ifs. Anyways, those are, like, languages that I wanted to learn. I don't think I've left any out. This is just an edit while I'm editing these videos. <laughs> to say hello in German is guten tag, or hallo. Um, <laughs> don't know why that slipped my mind, but I was watching it, and I was like, oh, I don't know how to say hello in German, and I'm like, dude, it's guten tag, totally, I've seen it in so many movies, dang, also, another language I would really like to learn is Cherokee, um, my Native American, um, nationality would be Cherokee, uh, Indian, because I'm white, black, and Cherokee Indian, so I would always, I've always wanted to get more in touch with my Cherokee side, um, so yeah. Yeah, I don't think I've left any out. I think I know those are the ones that I have dabbled in so far. But, like, oh, and I want to learn Elvish. I want to learn Elvish so bad. Ooh, and I don't like I mean, any other Elvish language except for the main one that people want to learn, and that's Tolkien's, um, Elven language. Because, yes. Like, yee. I'd rather, whether it's Kenyan or, uh, Sindarin, um, or Sindar and whatever, I want to learn both of those. And then I want to learn the, like, old, old, old Numenor, uh, uh, language, like, like, the ancient languages of it, because he's, like, epic, epic, epic. 
I'm like geeking out because I love that language. I love it. I want to be an elf. Let me be an elf. Nah. I don't know. I think it'd be cool though. Oh, an ancient Egyptian. I don't want to learn modern day Egyptian, like, unless it'll help me learn ancient Egyptian. I want to learn, like, ancient, ancient Egyptian. Like, I want to walk up and just start talking to you in ancient Egyptian and, like, you know, be legit. I don't know. I'm sure there are more languages that I'd like to know, but, you know, I think those are the main ones, honestly. I'd like to be able to speak to birds and, like, animals. Like, there is actually a thing. Like, it's an actual, like, language that you learn and you could, like, speak to the birds with it. Like, it's, like, certain whistles. Like, I mean, it's not like, oh, I'm going to mimic you so you come up closer. Like, there was, like, a class on it. We learned about it in class. It has something to do with the alphabet and, like, musical notes or something. And, like, you kind of talk to the birds. Like, I don't I don't literally want to be like, hey, bird, how are you today? And then, like, the bird would be like, chirp, chirp, chirp. I'll clean your house for you. <laughs> but I would love to be able to call animals to me. Like, whether, like, I'm sitting there and I have, like, a bird over there. I'm like, I can whistle to it. And it'll be like, <laughs> and I can be like, Instagram. And I can, like, oh, there's bunnies over there. And I can do something. And the bunny will come over. And I'm like, <laughs> Instagram. Everything's going to go on Instagram. <laughs> I would be like, look at my new friends. They're amazing. <laughs> I don't know. It'd be awesome. So yeah, like, I guess those are a few of the languages I'd like to know. Um, I'd like to speak whale. I, I don't want to, like, you, you, you know what I mean. I was about to do it. I was going to do it, but I just can't. I'm going to do it. <laughs> I love that movie. I, I like Finding Nemo. And, like, I want to speak whale. <laughs> um... I just love that part so much where she's like, oh, I can speak whale. And uh, he's like, no, no, you can't speak whale. And she's like, yes, I can. <laughs> um, Yeah, anyways, I think I should probably cut this out. Or not cut this out, but cut this video. Because I was supposed to make like a short little video. And it's not very short at all. Um, Anyways, guys, I'm calling this episode. Uh, if you like this episode, please leave a like. It's right over there. Um, if you don't like this episode, you can hit the dislike button. It's in the exact same place, except it's like a little further over, like towards that little corner right over there, like right there. Um, or you can go down below and leave a comment, and I will read it and weep and get back out there. No, I won't weep, but I'll be like, hey guys, what's up? I'm loving it. Da 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 da. I'm just kidding, I'm not gonna do that. Shh, shh. I'm not sponsored by McDonald's. Um, anyways, uh, if you'd like, you could always, uh, follow me for more things that I've done. And to do that, you could just go over to Facebook, Twitter, or Tumblr, or DeviantArt, or Instagram. Or you could just click the link in the description and subscribe to me, which would be super awesome, and I would love it so much, and I will hold you very dear to my heart. And if you don't, I will still love you and hold you close to my heart because you came here and you watched my video. And that's what counts. Like, I just like for people to watch my videos, honestly. It really makes me kind of happy. <laughs> like, I love the fact that people actually come here and they watch my video and they're just not like, You suck! Because, I mean, like, it's it's cool. It's cool. I like for people to laugh. Laugh at me. Like, ugh. Wah. Ugh. Who wants to have a sleepover? I need, I want, I want a onesie pajama. Like, one of those, like, old, old, like, timey kind. Or, like, a footed pajama. I want footed pajamas. I want footed pajamas and those little, like, drop seat things on there. Like, where, like, the little butt flap thing. <laughs> like that you had on like the old long johns i want one of those because whenever i was growing up i always wanted long johns because i thought it was hilarious and it's cool and i wanted one but i want footed pajamas with a hood it doesn't have to have a hood but i want footed pajamas that'd be amazing i had gone over by a lot so hopefully with the editing and everything i can get this video back down to like its regularly scheduled time anyways guys i love you very much 
I don't know if I'm missing out on anything. If I am, you guys watch my videos enough probably to know what I'm missing out on my outro. My outros and intros are always a disaster. Just remember that. But I love you guys, and I will catch you guys in the next episode. No. <laughs> Did I scare you? I scared myself a little bit. I thought I was going to knock my camera off. <laughs> but I'll catch you guys in the next episode. Bye, guys. Now I have to calm down and go to bed.